feel like every time I seem to have more plushies over here when I make a video. But anyway. Hey guys, I'm LDP and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to make your own fake septum piercings. Now, I don't know if this is just me, but I feel as though I have some serious commitment issues when it comes to things like piercings and bright hair colours because I love the look of them on other people, but I know that if I get them myself, I'm going to love it for about one day and then probably wake up and hate everything about it just because that's who I am. But I really love the look of septum piercings and I decided why not make them? So I did. Anyway, before I ramble on too much longer, let's go ahead and get into the DIY. To make your own fake septum piercing, you will need some fairly large jump rings, beads, chain and other items to decorate your fake septum piercing, some pliers, and some epoxy glue or super glue. Start by cutting off about 3mm of your jump ring near the join. Next, carefully bend back a little bit of the end of one side of the jump ring. This might be a bit tricky and could take a few tries. Repeat this on the other side too. Push the two edges close together using your fingers or pliers. It's a good idea to try it on at this point to make sure that you're happy with the size and shape. If you want your septum ring to have a bead on it, add the bead after turning the first side but before turning the other side. Once you turn over the other side, the bead will be secured. To make a fancier septum ring, I used some diamante chain I found in a nail art kit. Simply cut the chain to the length you need, add your epoxy glue or super glue and carefully glue it on. Wait for the glue to dry and your septum ring is complete. 